Okay, I'm here to help me demonstrate my rope making machine is Alice and Bob. And this is what you call a shuttle, and you'll see how that works in just a few minutes. But first we're going to take um, some same twine and our same twine. This is a lot easier to do it this way. Typically you're supposed to have a big bolt of this stuff rolling on this here, but I don't have a big bolt, so hold that. I'm going to set line here just do a couple of twists and just to make it go a little bit faster I'm gonna go ahead and do four lines on each just because I have to have a return down to the next hook so I'm gonna do four there keep them nice and snug um, you can go under you go those nice and snug and then I'm going to go up to this one here and then I'm going to twist it there. And then back up to this one here. And then scissors. Anybody put scissors? That was one thing we needed. I you need a pair of scissors. Yeah, I'll scrub it. Okay, so this down here. So I'm going to go ahead and tie this off with a couple of half hitches. And I cut it a little bit too short, but that's okay. Life goes on. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is you're going to hold this still so it doesn't turn, and you're going to crank this counterclockwise. Counterclockwise. Yes. So the ropes, these single pieces are all twisting clockwise. So just keep cranking. You can crank it a lot faster. that's good okay so at this point you're gonna hold still keep yours still and you're gonna crank yours clockwise or counter yeah, whatever Cut. this way yeah. oh wait 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 that's where this little guy comes in oh that keeps it tight yeah okay. so you're gonna keep cranking and you can see as it's going it's putting that into a nice perfect little lay nice You can crank faster, Alice. Okay. Not that we're in a hurry. Like you're doing ice cream. Yeah. All right. That's really cool. Wow. And as you notice, as it's twisting, the carriage is coming closer. So that was one of the little bugs that I had to work out as I had to. Okay, that's pretty good right there. So, another piece of. So as I said, as, as you twist, the carriage is going to come closer, so that's why I had to put a spring at this end to accommodate to keep the tension on the, um, on the line. So this end, you can actually just, you could seize it with a real fancy seizing if you have time, or you can just do a couple of half hitches on there just to keep it nice and tight. And then you do the same at this end. and you can actually just pull those off or you can come in. And there you go. Use the rope. Hey. <laughs>